back. Let's see what's going on with sports highlights. Those are some really cool highlights. Next is Titan Innovations. Hi guys, welcome back to Titan Innovations and today we're gonna to be talking about some hacks. Well, you know how this goes, so let's get straight to it. If you guys wish you had leftover pizza that was just as crisp and cheesy as the day you got it, try this life hack. What you wanna do is get your pan Take your leftover pizza, turn on the pan. There's some ice cubes over there. What you want to do is just put a cover on top of it and let it sit. It definitely is the best and easiest way to reheat your pizza. You don't even have to wait that long too. Here, check it out. Mm, mm mm that looks good. Just as fresh as the day it was made. Use an innovation with those with an air fryer. Does your air fryer look like this? If so, you only need two things, water and soap. This is how you clean it. This is also for lazy people like me. You're just gonna do a little bit of water, not too much. A little bit of dish soap. And then what you're gonna do is just gonna put it in the air fryer. And you're just going to turn it on for 10 to 15 minutes. Alright, let's take a look. Alright, all you got to do is rinse. Just with a few rinses. Super clean and easy way to do that. That's all the innovations for this week, Titans. Thank you, Powai. Now back to you, Ezra. Thanks, Evan. Those are pretty sick. Next up, we have ASB Cribs. I'm Samantha, and I was running for sophomore vice president. I'm Celeste, and I was running for freshman vice president. So what has the election process been like for you, Sam? So this past week has been stressful for me, but I've been able to post TikToks and Canvas every day on my social media. And I've also been able to post all my friends wearing uh, all my merch. And what has it been like for you, Celeste? I would also say that it's been stressful, but it's definitely been fun trying to campaign and get word around. Hey Titans, I'm Sienna. I'm Cameron. I'm, I ran for sophomore class president. And I ran for sophomore class vice president. What was your campaigning strategy for you, Cameron? Um, my campaigning strategy, I posted many Canvas every single day throughout the week. And I reached out to all my friends to post them as well. And what was it like for you? Uh, I put up a bunch of posters around the school to try to get the word out. I also uh, just told all my friends to repost my stories and just try to tell everyone Thanks guys, and now 
back to the anchors. Thanks, Nash and Chloe. Next is yoga and meditation. Did you start? Hey Titans, welcome back to another section of yoga and Fortnite. Hey Titans, I'm Justin. And I'm Nicholas. And welcome back to another section of yoga and meditation. On today's segment, we will be combining the tingling phenomenon of ASMR and yoga. Before today's festivities, let's start with a little warm-up. Now, we'll get straight into the yoga ASMR edition. Starting things off, we will activate the corpse position. This pose is simple, but is an important position in restorative yoga. This pose can help manage stress by activating the relaxation response. Next, we'll do the crow pose. Unlike the last, this position requires strength and focus to keep your body in a stable position. Keeping your hands planted on the floor, shins resting upon your arms, and lift your feet up to activate the crow pose. Finally, the mountain pose. This is a basic yoga position that allows one to practice proper alignment and muscle engagement as you quiet your mind. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did, Tynes. I'm feeling tingly and relaxed. Thank you for joining us on yoga and meditation. Now back to you, Ezra. I'll make sure to try out those relaxing moves. Next up is Poly Entertainment. Hello Titans, welcome back to Poway Entertainment. Our movie of the week is Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. Let's go check out the trailer. Gracias, the legend will never die! Our Netflix movie of the week is Tick Tick Boom. Let's go watch the trailer. Can I hear it? Any day now. Eight years! And the time keeps ticking. Our concert of the week is the Cruel World Festival. The festival will be on May 20th in Pasadena, California. The artist we will be highlighting this week is Love and Rockets. Our song of the week is So Alive by Love and Rockets. Let's go listen to it. Our throwback song of the week is It's My Life by Talk Talk. Let's go check it out. Well, that's all we have for this week, Poway. Now back to the Yankers. Thanks, Josh and Nash. Now that's all we have for this week. Have, have a, a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. Wednesday.